swag rewards excellence and as we know over the years we've always been doing that and it's the longest running award ceremony that we have in the country and this year um, talking about an event which is going to happen or supposed to happen in December won't be different. I'm just running you through um, what we are supposed to do or what we've started doing already for the 47th SWAG Awards nomination process. Already a nine-member committee headed by Mr. Franco Uswansa, a SWAG member who is also an executive member of the Ashanti Regional Branch has, is in place and they've started work. Um, it's through this committee that a lot of the work will be done through. Um, that nine-member committee is also supposed to um, be sending a link which is approved by the SWAG ESCO. Which th this link will be sent to all the national federation members, after which five members each of any federation will also be forwarded to SWAG. The five members will be approved by ESCO and the committee together with the membership, the general membership of SWAG will also add yes, which the committee will run through all these nominations for a further presentation to the SWAG Awards um, Committee after which the ESCO will also approve it. A similar link I've already said will also be shared to members after which the nomination when approved by the ESCO will be finally voted on by the SWAG General Assembly. That's what we've always been doing. Each member with each vote, one vote, um, will vote on these um, nominations, after which the announcement will be done. Normally, it's done around Christmas, and this year, it will be done around 31st December. That's the date which the nominations will be announced. 31st December 2022, um, 2022 sorry. That will be when the announcement will be done um, for the final list of the nominees and award um, the award nominees. This is the seven pointer process through which SWAG will nominate our people for them to receive the awards.